Okay, Mr. Phobes, so the last step is um, how to save the file and then um, uh, how we're going to do it, how we're going to save it for uh, laser cut. So what we're going to do is we're going to make a copy of this. So I've still got it in trim view, which makes it a little bit easier to work with. Um, I'm going to hit the, uh, I've selected the whole uh, project, I'm gonna hit the option, and I'm going to drag it over to the next artboard, and I'm going to make it line up with that, okay? Now, with everything selected, what I want to do is I'm going to change this from uh, fill to line. So I've got to go up to the default um, window here, select that, okay? And then uh, we're going to click off the uh, fill and then bring the line forward. And there it is. It's uh, Now it's in its line form, and that's uh, basically what we want to do. Uh, there will be a separate uh, tutorial on how to uh, set this into the um, uh, uh, template for guiding, but that's uh, for laser cutting, but that's basically it, okay? So um, we've got uh, two files here. Um, the reason I set up these other artboards is it gives you the opportunity to, you know, play around with uh, different compositions, all right? But uh, I want to save this, and the first thing I want to do is I want to go File, Save As. I'm just going to save the whole thing as an Illustrator file. So I'm going to call this Equivocal. Okay, and I'm going to save it to my desktop, and I'm just going to save it as an uh, Illustrator file. Save. So, um, okay, that way um, I've got the whole uh, thing set up. Now, what I want to do is uh, this line drawing uh, I'm going to export uh, to use for the laser cutting. I'm going to export it separately, uh, but I need to export as an Illustrator file. So um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the um, artboard tool here, and um, I'm going to go uh, File, save as and um, I'm going to just save both of these which is fine so I'm going to save it as an illustrator file and um, even though I'm going to use the artboards uh, we have to do this first I'm going to go save and then um, so I need to give it a different name uh, because I'm going to call it squivel cool space 2 I didn't want to replace that and then I'm going to go uh, save to the desktop okay um, and then what I want to do is select this it says save each artboard as a separate file go to range and I'm going to do one through two okay and then hit okay and then if I go to my messy desktop here um, I should see uh, there they are right there so it says equivocal space 2-01 and then equivocal space 2-02. That's the file that we're going to use in the uh, laser cutting right there. Okay, so that's how you save that.